Hi, I'm Gerald and this is going to be a demonstration of how to set up a remote desktop in Windows and how to remotely connect to a Windows workstation from a Linux workstation. The first step that we need to do is adjust the settings for remote connections. And to do that, we need to go to Control Panel. So for Windows 10 to get the Control Panel, we can right click on the Start button and select Control Panel. And to adjust the remote desktop connection settings, we can go to system and security system and then find the remote settings option and that will bring up the system properties remote tab and for windows 10 it gives us two options don't allow remote connections and allow remote connections we want to make sure allow remote connections is selected and that allow connections from computers running remote desktop with network level authentication is checked. Next we can go to select users and select which users that we want to connect remotely and we can click add and type in a username. So I'll just type in my username and verify it and click OK and I can see that it added my username here to the remote desktop users. I'll go ahead and click OK and OK. Windows 7 does this slightly different, so I'll switch to the Windows 7 machine and show you that. You can go to Computer and select Properties to go to the Remote Settings. And this brings up the System Properties box. And the Remote Desktop options down here at the bottom, we can see that it gives you two options whereas Windows 10 gives you one with a sub option. So Windows 7 says allow connections from Windows run any version of remote desktop and allow connections only from computers running remote desktop with network level authentication. And I'm going to be using the third one since it offers more security. And just like in Windows 10 you can select the users just click the add button here and type in the users that you want to allow to connect remotely and we can see the user was added here you can click OK and OK next I'm going to switch back to the Windows 10 machine and to connect remotely I need to find out the IP address so I'll just type in command to bring up a command prompt and I'll use the IP config utility to find out the IP address and we can see that the IP address for this Windows 10 machine is 192.168.200.13 and that's the address I'll be using. Next I can switch to the Linux machine and log in And the first thing I need to do on a Linux machine is find or install a remote desktop application. And I'm using Ubuntu desktop and this version had a remote desktop application pre-installed. So I'll just type in remote and it brings up our remote desktop client here. And the first thing I need to do is to select the connection type. And I'll be using RDP, which stands for Remote Desktop Protocol, which is the Windows Remote Connection Protocol. And I'll just type in the IP address of the Windows 10 machine here. And it's 192.168.200.13. And click Connect. Now, what's our username? And password and this is one of the authorized users for the remote connection so now we can see the Windows 10 machine is being brought up just like we left it and we have access to 
do anything on this remote connection that we can on the actual machine itself. So one of the things I want to do is add a new user. So I can go to computer management and go to local users and groups. Go to user and right click and add a new user. So the new user that I want to add is John Brown. So we'll just type in J Brown for his username. And his full name is John Brown. Description is employee. And password. And verify the password. And click create to create the new user and I can see here that John Brown user was created so this is a remote connection so I'll go ahead and end the connection and switch back to the actual Windows 10 machine by logging in And I can see that the Windows 10 machine is exactly like it was left from the remote connection. And I can see that the user John Brown was in fact created on the Windows 10 machine. So this completes the setup of Windows Remote Desktop and a demonstration of how to connect to a Windows workstation from a Linux workstation using Remote Desktop.